free Palestine! Free, free Palestine! Free, free Palestine! Good morning, everybody. How are you feeling? Hey, everyone. My name is Lenny. They, them. Bus Captain 3. So, so honored and excited to be here with you today. Bus 3 is in the front. We're going to line up, and I'm going to double check that you're on the bus. My name is Lennox Dietz, everyone calls me Lenny, I'm 26 years old. I'm an, an organizer with the Party for Socialism and Liberation, or a national organization, and I'm also working with the Answer Coalition that's Act Now to Stop War and End Racism. My, my role today is going to be bus captain and chant lead. So as bus captain, I'm going to make sure that everyone gets to the action safe and everyone has what they need. As chant lead, I'm going to be leading chants to um, get the energy up, keep the crowd hype. So Artists Against Apartheid is a uh, collective of poets, artists, uh, singers, dancers, folks who really want to uplift the struggle that Palestinians are, are facing here in the United States and abroad. Um, at the march, there's going to be a contingent of artists who are marching to really, really uplift and show the world that artists um, are not in favor of this war and that they want to see a world where we're not seeing children in Gaza being bombed every day, but that the artists really care about building a world where there will be a ceasefire, this, this violence will stop, and, and that our art will mean something um, toward, toward building peace globally. Whew. Yes. Uh, this march really demonstrated the power of the people. It was incredible to see how many people came out in force. I was telling folks on the ground that this was probably the biggest march I've, I've ever seen in years. Just so many folks all coming together to say a resounding no to war in Palestine and war in Gaza. Sound was a, a huge, uh, huge thing today, right? So you had the sound going on the main stage. So that passion really came through. People, um, in fact, the person interviewing me, chanting um, and, and leading chants, for a straight 10 minutes in the march just because of that that passion and, and demonstration of solidarity with the people. My message to the Palestinian people is the Bronx is with you. We see what you're going through. We believe strongly that our tax dollars shouldn't be funding the active ethnic cleansing and genocide of your people. We see the connections between the New York Police Department who effectively occupy our neighborhoods that are being trained in Israel to kill black and brown people in the streets dead, acting as judge, jury, and executioner of our boys and our girls and our children. And we say no. We say that that's not right and that we have to do something about it and that we stand in solidarity with seeing the way that the IDF does the same thing to people in Palestine. We say no. We say that that is, is not right and we want to put an end to it today.